is President Trump starting to lose his clout? He lost a seat in Texas where he said, go ahead and vote for this woman. She lost. He told that he told the senators they are wimps if they try to pass that new infrastructure bill. Immediately after saying that, they said, we have an agreement. And now we have Susan Collins going on national TV. And even though she has al al already said that Donald Trump is uh, kind of culpable for January 6th, she did not mince her, mince her words this time around as she made it really clear who is responsible for January 6th. Check this out. Normally, if you have a select committee... Uh, the minority leader and the speaker get to pick the members. Yeah, I mean, the, <clears throat> just to, the reason she did that is because at least two of the members McCarthy picked to be on the committee are election liars, one of whom, Jim Jordan, is possibly even a material witness. He spoke with Trump that day. Well, there were many communications with uh, President Trump that day. And, and look, as you know, I believe that... Uh, he that while the writers are primarily responsible for what happened, there's no doubt in my mind that President Trump uh, helped instigate to, uh, uh, and motivate the writers. And uh, that's one reason I voted to impeach him. The hallmark of our democracy is the peaceful transfer of power. And for anyone the writers, the president, anyone to try to interfere with the electoral college count is completely unacceptable. Now tell me, I don't think you can get much clearer than that. And uh, I think uh, if Trump still had the power that he has, and as much as Susan Collins still have, I think, five more years left on her uh, to be, to be reelected if she so chooses... Uh, Republicans have been very, very careful in going up against Donald Trump, but I think he may be losing his mustard. So, and as much as he still have big support in the Republican Party, I think that's going to wane, and I think that's going to wane pretty fast. And I think what the DOJ also has in store for him is forthcoming. We'll see. Mark my word. We spend a lot of time deconstructing the news, trying to trying to parse it into a form that everybody can understand. We try to find those little nitpicks where uh, it goes, it flies above the fray, etc. If you really like these videos that we do, I want to ask a big favor. Please go ahead, number one, subscribe to our channel, and number two, please join if you can. Thank you so kindly for watching. Keep watching. Please remember to share. We must populate the entire internet with our progressive message, a message that we know is what most Americans say that they want. So help us please join.